The fluid in your brake system absorbs water over time, leading to a spongy brake pedal feel. You should change your fluid every two years or at the first sign of soft pedal. If you are bleeding the system and have not opened any brake lines between the master and the ABS pump, you can just use a power bleeder. If you have allowed any air into the system between the master and the ABS pump, you will need to also have to place the system into bleed mode with your scan tool. Ordinary power bleeding will not get air out from the ABS pump. When bleeding the brakes, always start with new, fresh, unopened can of a proper brake fluid for your 997.2. Never use a can that has been sitting open on a shelf as it will have already absorbed water. A word of warning, brake fluid will destroy the paint on your car. Make sure not to get any on you or your clothes and transfer it to the paint while performing this work. Begin by safely raising and supporting the car as well as removing the wheels. Then open the front trunk and fill your power bleeder with new fluid and attach the cap to the top of the brake fluid reservoir indicated by the red arrow. I had the complete brake system off of the car so I removed the trim panels around the master to check for leaks. If you want to remove the panels and need extra assistance, please follow the link provided at the end of this video. Pump the pressure up to around 1 bar, red arrow. Porsche calls for the system to be bled at 2 bars, but I find that most commercial bleeders do not like that much pressure. The bleeder should hold pressure. If it does not, you have a leak somewhere. Stop and solve the leak problem before continuing. You're going to need a flared nut wrench for the bleed nipples. Ours were 11mm on the rear and 10mm on the front. We use the Schwaben catch bottle and tube. It has a great rubber connector on the end of the tube that stops any spillage and helps hold the wrench in place. The bottle hooks up to the caliper. It is important to the order that you bleed your calipers. Start with the caliper furthest from the master, which is the right rear, then the left rear, right front, and front left. The calipers on the 997.2 have two bleed nipples. Always bleed the outer nipple first. Open the bleeder valve, blue arrow, and allow fluid to flow out until there are no more bubbles in the tube, red arrow. This image shows that the system is not completely bled yet. Once done, start the car to get some brake pressure in the booster and try the brake pedal. If it is still soft, bleed the system again. Once completed, depressurize the bleeder before opening anything. Remove the bleeder and top up or remove fluid until it is between the minimum and maximum lines on the reservoir. If you have replaced the ABS pump, introduced air into the pump, or cannot get a firm brake feel, you must use your scan tool to set the ABS pump into bleed mode. Leave the power bleeder attached and pressurized. Attach your scan tool and go into the brake menu and set it for ABS bleed mode. Bleed the calipers in the sequence the scan tool instructs you to. It should be rear left, front left, front right, rear right. Throughout the entire bleeding process, the brake pedal must be held depressed for two or three seconds, then release slowly. After operating the pedal for the last time, hold the brake pedal down and close the bleeder valve. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.